Hi everyone. In this video, we will show you how to add a countdown timer to an email template with Unlayer. As you can see in these templates, countdown timers instill a sense of urgency in your readers and make your emails look attractive. For this video, we chose to insert a timer into this template. So, let's get started. You can see a promotional email template here that we showed you earlier. We will add a countdown timer to it and adjust its properties later. Here is our timer feature. We will simply drag and drop this feature towards the template. Once we do so, you can see that a countdown timer has appeared on the template. Now, we will click on this timer and all of its properties will display in front of us. The first property that we can see here is the end time. For this video, let's just assume today is the 23rd of February. So, if we want our timer to end on the same date we will set it for the 23rd of February. When we do this, you'll see that the countdown timer will exclude the part where it says days and appear in hours, minutes, and seconds only. On the other hand, let's say our sale ends after 3 days, then we will set the date for 3 days later, that is 26th of February. When we do this, the countdown timer will appear in days, hours, minutes, and seconds. You can adjust it according to you. Moving on, we will click on time to select a time for this email. Since here the time appears in 24 hour clock, so when we clicked on 16 the time will be set to 4 pm. Next, we will move towards this section for the time zone and select a country or time zone. For this email, we selected the time zone of America Argentina San Juan. You can set it according to your choice. Right after we click on the time zone you can see that the countdown timer will be set accordingly. Moving forward, here we have a section for languages. From here, you can select a language of your choice. For instance, when we click on Chinese, the language of the countdown timer will switch to Chinese. And when we select Dutch the language will change to Dutch. But for this email template, we will select the English language so that the timer appears in English. Next, here is an option to adjust labels. If we switch it off, the labels for days, hours, minutes, and seconds will disappear. If you want to see these labels then you can switch them on. After this, we will move towards the color of the countdown timer which has been divided into three parts. That is, the background color, digits color, and labels color. You can select and add any color of your choice. For example, we want to change the color of the background to green, so we'll add the color code for our desired green color, and it will appear on the background. Similarly, you can change the color of the digits according to your choice as well. Let's say we want the digits for this countdown to be yellow. So, we'll click on yellow, and you can see that the color of the digits has changed to yellow. However, for this template, we will stick to white colored digits. In the same way, you can change the color of the labels as well. We have a wide color range to choose from. But for this template, we chose white colored labels to suit our design. Next, here's a section that allows you to select fonts for digits and labels. Plus, there is an option to choose the size of the fonts and digits as well. For instance, for this template we want to change the font of the digits to Helvetica, so we will simply click on the drop-down menu and select Helvetica from the options. Similarly, we want to change the font of the labels to Helvetica too, so we will click on the menu and choose that from the options. In the same way, you can change the size of the digits according to your choice. To decrease the size click on the minus button. And to increase it click on the plus button. For this template, we will set the size of the digits to 75 and adjust the size of the labels to 28. As you can see here, the digits and labels look pretty well balanced with these measurements. Next, we will adjust the properties of the image. The first option we have here is Auto Width, 
By switching it off you can adjust the size of the countdown timer according to your choice. And for this template, we'll set it on 65. Moving on, we have an option to adjust the alignment of the timer. You can pick an adjustment of your choice from these four options. It can be either right, center, left, or justify. For this template, we will center align the countdown timer. And that's about it. Our promotional email template with a countdown timer is now ready. For final touches, we will preview our template to check its responsiveness on all devices. As you can see our templates display perfectly on every device. All the more reason to use Unlayer's email templates. And we're all set. This is how you add a countdown timer in an email template with Unlayer. Quick and easy isn't it? So, what are you waiting for? Start creating engaging emails with Unlayer. Subscribe now.